outside this morning. I even packed a jacket in my backpack. <laughs> really? Yeah. I think bringing a jacket when it's like 75 degrees outside might be one of the more Mexican things you've ever done. <laughs> it's not cold in the least. It does feel good though. It feels like it's high season. It feels like it's winter time here. Yeah, I think the sun, the sun came out so it feels a little warmer, but this is bliss. We found this new cafe new to us. It's only been open three months, 1983. We'll put the directions down below. We drove by it the other day. You guys know we love coffee. We had to yeah. try it. After studying Spanish this morning, and then just being absolutely brain dead afterwards, we needed a little caffeine. Pick me up before, after. <laughs> Can we go back to before? <laughs> after this espresso. It's a normal size cup. Is it a normal size cup? <laughs> no, this espresso is delicious. I'm feeling, I'm perking up a little bit. Show after me your Spanish. before and after. After. <laughs> <laughs> Strangely similar. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Change of plans. We had intended on staying at home, getting some kind of boring computer work yeah. done. But once we saw and felt just how nice it was outside today, yeah. we had to come down here to the beach. I mean, look at it. Look Not at super that. easy to crutch down in sand. But I'm doing it. So I'm, worth it. This is not Look at back. you. Wow. I feel like my body hasn't seen sun in weeks. Yeah, I just asked if, if you had sunscreen. We're only gonna be out here for a few minutes, but yeah, I feel like my skin is just like soaking it in. It's just like being drenched in sunlight. Now, here's the thing about changing plans <laughs> and us. A little thing, a little something about us is I would say Hillary and I can be a little much type A sometimes. What, what is type A again? Type A is... Oh wait, the mangoes are walking our way. Oh. Can we talk Say it, Conto. Sorry about that. We uh, we had mangoes on our mind. We saw them. Priorities. We attacked. This mm. was uh, mm. 40 pesos for that. How are those? Mm. Perfectly sun-dried. Oh, perfectly <laughs> sun-dried with a little bit of tahini and chamoy on there. Some salt. Know. We used to think, not that long ago, call us crazy. We used to think not that long ago, like, who wants a mango after it's been walking around in the sun all day? We do. <laughs> I think the sun actually ripens them a little bit as he's walking, they get and sweeter like and sweeter. it's warm and mushy. I know, I realize this sounds horrible, but like, if you could choose between a fresh, maybe perhaps like grocery store cold mango or one that's been walking in the sun all day, sun. sun. <laughs> this is a lie. This is a lie. It really is a simple thing. Like a warm, That's delicious. Mushy mango. If you've never had a warm, mushy mango <laughs> with tahin and chamoy on it in a beach in Vallarta, you haven't lived. Okay, we can be a little type A, meaning uh, I think when we're in Vallarta, whenever we're not traveling, we tend to like schedule out our whole day when we're gonna work out, when we're gonna study Spanish, yeah. when we're gonna do emails, when we're gonna uh, like edit. Review yeah, the like video, publish work, the video, computer work. work, and maybe just because it's so type A, we, I know it doesn't seem that way on videos, you're, you're like shaking your head at us, but we don't, some, we don't always stop to smell the roses here in Vallarta. We don't always, we don't, we're not very balanced sometimes is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, like we're not like super spontaneous, or like yes. we get a plan for the day and we tend to stick to that plan. And actually a few weeks ago we went to the beach on the weekend and it was like yes. spontaneous and we decided to come out here, stay the whole day. Yeah. And I feel like it was one of the funnest days because, I don't know, everyone leaves. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, pigeon. <laughs> everyone needs like a little spontaneity and that is what we're practicing okay, today. Uh, gracias. I know you're sitting there watching like, what the heck are you talking about? You guys are always eating the best food and going to beaches and traveling. And yes, that is true. But... Sometimes we need to lighten up a little bit, right? Yeah, sometimes what you don't see on camera, we can be too serious. So this is just a gentle reminder to ourselves 
to just change plans. Be <laughs> happy. What? Don't worry, be happy now. Did the doctor say I could get in the ocean? He did actually, didn't he? He did. I think I think we asked I asked him that like joking. I was like, but how are you supposed to swim in the ocean? Just trying to be He said funny. as long as I take off the boot and be careful, I'm fine. So here we Shouldn't go. Shouldn't have asked. Wow. Wait, you're Fitbit. <laughs> It was your great. first beaching. Uh, it felt so good. How's the foot? It feels great. Looks good. I think I need, I think the cure to healing is more sunshine, more sand, more salt, and more mangoes, and tequila. Oh my gosh. Anything else? <laughs> but I see ya, that's actually what we have in the fridge. But I see ya instead of tequila, maybe. The truth is, we do actually have a little bit of work to get done, <laughs> and our skin is not going to last very long without any sunscreen on here. Yeah. So. What's for dinner? I dropped a little eggshell in there. Be careful when you're eating; you might have a small piece of eggshell. A small piece? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Ow! Ah. Uh. Yeah. Eggs and pro pancakes. protein leftover protein leftover pancakes. Pro Except that. Yep, this is living the dream. <laughs> oh, egg show and all. This looks pretty good. That's a dinner champ right there. <laughs> <laughs> it's no Argentinian empanadas, but hey, I mean, yesterday we proclaimed that Argentinian empanadas were better than Mexican food. I think that would put them above scrambled eggs and leftover pancakes. <laughs> <laughs>